family. One of my passions is gardening. So I especially love it when biblical writers use agricultural metaphors for God's love and our life in Christ, as we find in Psalm 126. Earlier this year, I had the chance to plant a sizable garden at a friend's farm. On a bit of a whim, we decided to plant a type of squash I've never planted before, a winter squash called the Jumbo Pink Banana Squash. We put four little seedlings in the ground, not knowing what would happen, and lo and behold, they produced some seriously jumbo squash. I cooked one up last weekend, and that squash weighed in at 21 pounds and gave me over 19 cups of pureed goodness. That is more, in case that's hard to wrap a mind around, that's more than you'd get buying a whole case of canned pumpkin at Costco, all from one squash. Now how it goes as a plant from a seed to a plant that bears fruit to 19 cups of pumpkiny goodness is truly nothing short of a miracle. And one of the biggest things that gardening teaches me year after year is that the miracles from the natural world point us to the miracle of God's love. God's love, which was born to us as baby Jesus. Jesus who himself grew up and ultimately transformed this world. There's so much to love this time of year between Thanksgiving and the season of Advent and the coming of Christmas. At the same time, the holidays can be difficult. And if that's the case for you this season, I encourage you to give the Psalms a read. Be sure to read Psalm 126, which reminds us that whenever life is hard and has us sowing tears, down the road, it will no longer be tears, but also joy. Just like a 21 pound squash was hard for me to imagine when I put those tiny little plants in the ground, joy can be hard to imagine when we're in the midst of tears. But friends, this is God's promise to us. It gets better. And the good news about being part of a family of faith is that you don't have to do it alone, no matter what season you're in. So my prayer in this season of Advent is that you will know joy, even if right now you know tears. For those who sow in tears will reap with shouts of joy, says the psalm. May it be so. Peace be with you, friends. Thank you.